Welcome back to Infigyan friends. In today's video, we are having one very interesting and challenging question from radical simplifications. Here we have to evaluate the expression x power 4 root x plus y power 4 root y given x and y in this manner. So let's consider this expression equal to e first. And I will begin with x and y simplification. So let me write here x value. From first two terms of the numerator, I can see root 5 is common. So let me write root 5 is common, then root 2 plus 1 will be in the bracket. From last two terms, we can see it is 1 common. So I can write root 2 plus 1 common denominator. From first two terms, root 5 is common out. So I will be writing root 2 plus 1. And from last two, it is minus 1 common. So in bracket, it would be root 2 plus 1. Now we can take root 2 plus 1 common out from numerator and denominator. And then this will be over. So x is converting into the simplified form root 5 plus 1 over root 5 minus 1. Similarly, y from first two. I will take root 5 common. So in bracket root 2 minus 1 will be left. From last 2 I will take minus 1 common. So root 2 minus 1 will be in the bracket. From first 2 I can see root 5 is common out in bracket root 2 minus 1. And from last 2 I will take 1 common. So it is root 2 minus 1. Now I can cancel from numerator denominator which is common term root 2 minus 1. So its simplified version will be root 5 minus 1 over root 5 plus 1. This is our y. Now I will rationalize our denominator. So I will multiply here with root 5 plus 1. So I need to multiply in the numerator also by the same bracket root 5 plus 1. Here I will be multiplying root 5 minus 1. Similar I will multiply root 5 minus 1 in the numerator also. Now if you will see the denominators it is a plus b a minus b. So I will write here a square minus b square and numerator is root 5 plus 1 whole square and denominator is root 5 is square 5 minus 1 is square so value will be 4 this is our x similarly y i will be writing here root 5 minus 1 whole square and denominator will be root 5 is square which is 5 minus 1 is square so 5 minus 1 is 4 again so this is our value of x and y I will demonstrate two different approaches. See how we will proceed. So let me write here x value. Let us expand root 5 plus 1 whole square. Let me write here approach number 1 or method number 1 divided by 4. Let's expand. So I will write a plus b whole square formula. So root 5 square is 5 plus 1 plus 2 root 5 divided by 4. So I can write 6 plus 2 root 5 divided by 4. Or I can write value of x will be 3 plus root 5 over 2. This is our x. Now y. y I will be writing here root 5 minus 1 whole square divided by 4. Expand a minus b whole square. a square 5 plus b square 1 minus 2ab 2 root 5 divided by 4. Or I can write 6 minus 2 root 5 divided by 4. 3 minus root 5 over 2. So x is 3 plus root 5 over 2. And y is 3 minus root 5 over 2. Let's find out x plus y. 
so i will write 3 plus root 5 over 2 plus 3 minus root 5 over 2 so we can cancel as denominators are same so it will give us 6 over 2 which will be equal to 3 let us consider product x times y so i will be writing 3 plus root 5 times 3 minus root 5 divided by 2 times 2. So a plus b, a minus b, a square which is 3 square 9 minus b square root 5 is square it is 5 over 4. So this is 4 over 4. Conclusion is x plus y is 3, x y is 1. Let me write here x plus y it is 3. Now we have to calculate our expression x power 4 root x plus y power 4 root y. Let us calculate x plus y equal to 3 and x y equal to 1 and this is the expression for which we are solving. Okay. Now I will write here root x plus root y whole square formula. If I will expand this then I will be writing root x square so x root y square so y plus 2ab term it will be 2 times root x times root y. Now x plus y is 3 so here I will be writing 3 plus 2 times root xy can we write? Further we can write it is 3 plus 2 root 1 or 3 plus 2, so 5. Conclusion is square root x plus square root y whole square, it is equal to 5. Consider square root both sides. So root x plus root y will be plus minus root 5. Now if you will see, x is positive, y is positive, so root x plus root y will be positive. So I will reject this minus sign. Let me write here rejected. So accepted value will be plus root 5 only. So root x plus root 5 equal to root 5. Now target expression is x power 4 root x. How it will possible? I will consider cubing of this equation. Let us consider cubing. So I will write root x plus root y equal to root 5. Let us consider cubing. So a cube, a cube will be root x whole cube plus b cube root y whole cube plus 3ab. 3 times root xy in bracket root x plus root y which will be root 5 right hand side is root 5 times root 5 times root 5 so 5 root 5 now here i will be writing root 5 and here i will be writing 1 root 1 is 1 so let me write here root x cube plus root y cube plus 3 root 5 equal to 5 root 5. Now I can consider this cube power inside this. So I will be writing root x cube plus root y cube equal to 2 root 5. 5 root 5 minus 3 root 5. Using identity is a power b whole power c. Any time we can write a power c whole power b. So this value will be x root x plus y root y equal to 2 root 5. Now still it is not our required expression. Now I will consider cubing once again. So let me write here power 3. Power 3 power 3. Now I will expand a plus b whole cube once again. 
so a cube so this time i will be writing x cube this is x cube only root x cube will be x root x this is our first term cube plus similarly i will write y cube then y root y plus 3 times xy square root xy this is 3 ab term now in bracket x root x plus y root y which we will write for the 2 root 5 right hand side is 2 root 5 whole cube so 8 times 5 40 root 5 it will be now you can see this is our x power 4 root x plus y power 4 root y now this is 1 this is 1 and this is 2 root 5 2 root 5 1 1 so i will be writing here 6 root 5 right hand side it is 40 root 5 and this is our required expression so let me write here e so i will write e plus 6 root 5 equal to 40 root 5 so our required expression using this approach it is 34 root 5 now approach number 2 let me write here approach or method number 2 if you see the value of x it was root 5 plus 1 whole square over 4 it was so i will calculate root x from here this value will be root 5 plus 1 over 2 similarly y this was root 5 minus 1 whole square by 4 which we calculated earlier simplified so root y i can write root 5 minus 1 over 2 so root x and root y calculation is over now only task left is x power 4 and y power 4 so let us write that x value in terms of 3 plus root 5 over 2 and y was 3 minus root 5 over 2 now i will calculate x square and then x power 4 so x square will be 3 square is 9 root 5 square is 5 2 root so i will write 6 root 5 divided by 4 here a square 9 b square 5 minus 6 root 5 over 4 this is our y square so x square i will be writing 14 plus 6 root 5 over 4 which will be 7 plus 3 root 5 over 2 this is our x square y square will be 14 minus 6 root 5 over 4 and we can write y square will be 7 minus 3 root 5 over 2 now again we will consider a square to collect the value of x power 4 and y power 4 so let me write here 7 plus 3 root 5 over 2 whole square this will be x power 4 similarly y power 4 will be 7 minus 3 root 5 over 2 whole square now i'll be writing 49 plus 3 square is 9 9 times 5 45 plus 42 root 5 over 4 and y4 i will be writing similarly this will be 49 plus 45 minus 42 root 5 over 4 so x power 4 and y power 4 is about to come this value will be 94 plus 42 root 5 over 
and here also 94 plus 42 it is minus so i will be writing minus 42 root 5 over 4 now divide so once i will divide i will be getting 47 plus 21 root 5 by 2 and here y power 4 will be 47 minus 21 root 5 over 4 See, this approach is looking very lengthy. Now, we have to calculate our expression value. See, it was E equal to. I will write x power 4. So, this bracket, this is x power 4. This is y power 4. Let me write here. 47 plus 21 root 5 over 2. This is x power 4. Now, root x. Root x was root 5 plus 1 over 2 plus y power 4 over 4 times root y root 5 minus 1 over 2. Now you can see this calculation will be I we have to multiply basically. Let's multiply. So, I will be writing here 47 root 5, then 47, then 21 times 5, 105, then 21 root 5, then 47 root 5 again, then minus 47, then minus 105, then plus 21 root 5, and denominator will be 4. Now you can see few terms we can cancel 47 105. Now if I will add all then it is 94 plus 42 root 5. 94 root 5 plus 42 root 5 which will give us 136 root 5 over 4. So this value will come out. What I should write it is our answer 34 root 5. This is how we can think about using this approach. And this is the end of this video. Thank you friends for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.